Today, we're gonna find out what the name of our baby is. Last to leave the bus, name the baby. Polo. Polo? Polo. <laughs> Last to leave the bus starts in. Three, two, one. All right, guys, welcome to the vlog today. We have a special treat. Coco is going to smash Paula right now. You get to witness it. No, that's not what's happening, you guys. Today, we're gonna find out what the name of our baby is. Our kids don't even know yet. Well, actually, we don't even know yet because we're doing a little challenge. Last to leave the bus, name the baby. Everybody's got maybe a name they've been I have thinking to win of. This one, oh, I want yes. to name. Davey it's doesn't want the name, but I want the uh -huh. name. April's got a name. Ooh, Paula I'm ready for has this. a really dumb name picked out. Do you want to reveal what your dumb name is? It's P A O. No, I don't even know how to spell it. It's Palolo. Polo. What do you want to name the baby, Evie? Polo. Polo? Okay, we got two for Polo. What, what would you name the baby? No, mine, I'll name, save it if I name anything. Mine is Pololo. Oh. Polo. Yeah. Mine is Cutie. Cutie? Cutie? Ambry, what would you name the baby if you had a choice? A baby boy? Bob. Wait, no, the first name is Billy. The second name. Okay, so Billy, Bob, Joe, or Gil. <laughs> what would you name, baby, if you had anything? You are I don't know. Okay. You don't have one picked out yet? I'll, I'll think about it. Okay. Can I have a thing about the M&M? So, we are doing the last to leave the bus gets to name our next child. April's anything. really pulling for it. I will throw up on people until she they She has leave. one that she really wants. <laughs> And if it comes down to that, I will throw up on people <laughs> until they leave. So we're going to drive around. We're going to see. I don't really know what to expect. I have a name that I think would be awesome. But um, I don't know how I'm going to get April off the bus because she really has a name picked out. Name I'm not feeling very well, kids. April's full day sickness is on point. Super strong right now. So she's a trooper to even Whenever you want to get off, just tell me your name and I'll do it now. How's your uh, sickness been? Extreme. Um, what percent of the day do you feel horrible? I'd say that you're 90. awake. That you're awake. Ninety. If I'm sleeping, it's fine. <laughs> if, you if I'm awake, the only time I feel okay is about thirty minutes after I've eaten a little bit of food. I can't eat too much. So if it was an option to go into a sleep-induced coma for the next take six it months, up. no, six weeks. Six weeks. Ten weeks even. Ten I would weeks. You would take, take it. it at any cost. <laughs> is that an option? <laughs> uh, no. Okay. Well, may the best man win, or woman, or child, or baby, Me. or dog. Or Daisy. We're gonna drive around, and um, I don't know. Uh, what do you think, Paula? What's gonna happen? Let's go. To I don't know. Quiz. It's getting crazy in here. Let's go to boring quiz. Coco, what do you think? She's like, Doggy. Uh, we updated two of the seats here. I cut this off this so seat cool. today, so this is kind of the party no, middle of the bus. Ella. 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 Oh, and Ella gets to come too. Oh. Before this video is Ella. over, Ella. you are going to know the name of the baby. Ella. Okay, last to leave the bus starts in. Three, two, one, go! Okay, you got to give mama her space. You got to give mama her space. So sorry. Quiet. Sorry. Quiet. So loud. You can do it. Sorry. Does this make, you can get off if you want to. It's fine. They're just making me really nauseous. It's fine. Oh, man. A few moments later. All right. I think Davey's going to go to the gas station and try to tip some of the kids out of the bus. Are you trying to sit in the bus or are you going to go out? I'm not going to go out. I'm not getting out. Oh. Where, where are we going to go? I'll just say you guys can take Dad's credit card and go in the gas station. That'll get them all out, and then it'll be between me and Davy, and I will throw up on him. Just kidding, he'll feel bad for me and leave. I got strategy. I got strategy. Okay, guys, I've got an idea. I think I'm gonna get most of the kids off the bus with this. The kids' favorite store to go to is the dollar store. I'm gonna offer them some money to go inside and buy something, and. They, I'm guessing they will not be able to resist me, so. Um, I think we're gonna knock out a, many birds with one stone right here. I think that'll work just fine. Oh, look, the 
Oh, the dollar store. That's a fun place. That's a really fun place. I don't know. Who wants to spend some money at the dollar store? Yeah, be the oldest one going in. This is for you and Amber. Good luck. Evie, 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 go. Take Evie. What do you think, Zane? Alright. Okay, go, Evie, go, go, go. Good luck, Might be the last store. Ender. I don't know if we're going. We're not, there's not going to be any other stores to go to. Can we have some dollars? Uh oh. Ender, Ender and Zane, half and half. Actually. We both get 10. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that knocked a few out. Paula, there's no way you're winning me. Oh, I know. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Thank you. Okay, I'm getting out. <laughs> <laughs> she ready to take her phone because she stayed. <laughs> give, me this one, give me the phone. Let's see it. Huh? Huh. Well, that was quick. That was it. All she needed was a threat to take away her phone. Okay, she got back in. She's like, I'll just get out and come back in. <laughs> I'm out! <laughs> All right, she lost. I guess it's just you and me. Just me and you, babe. Uh, this could go for a while. Let me tell the reasons why. Me and you and me. Okay, I want to tell You're you guys out, the reasons why I want to pick my name. While we were in Greece, I just had this strong feeling, and like I just kept thinking of one of my ancestors that has passed away. And I've done a lot of family history because of this person. And I don't know why, I just kind of like felt, it's weird to say like I kind of felt their presence, but I just kind of felt like I was thinking about that person a lot and I just kind of like was really like excited. And then there was a name that popped up while we were on the Greece trip from one of our trips in um, Italy, our very first couples trip. And maybe I have to just say the name. Can Paula just find out the name I want? No? Till the end. So Once come on. You win, no? anyway, so there, like, there was like all of these like similar names. Like the name kept popping up over and over and over again, and I was like, oh my gosh, that is such a great name. And then I realized it's a boy and a girl name. So this is before I knew that I was having a boy, but I was like, perfect. This is kind I, of like hints for you guys. Yeah. That the name that April wanted to choose. So um, then I'll tell you what we're actually gonna name yeah. it after I win the game. Oh, well, these are the name. This is the name <laughs> I want. You just stop that. <laughs> Okay, I'm going so to the win. Name is Paolo. So that name kept popping up, and then the plot thickens. So I told Davy the name, and he's like, eh, "No, <laughs> right?" He like it. it he pulled was... up all these YouTube videos of why he hated the name. No, I. It was. It's a name that I have. You know, if you knew somebody that had that name, or did, it's related to, like so a it just movie, has, like a funny movie that you don't really want to like name your kid after, like things like that. There's just a lot of other relations to the name. So he's like, "No." Uh-uh. And I was like, uh, honey, it's my ancestor's name and I love it and it could be for a boy or girl. I'm like, I just know that's the name. And then it gets even better. So I went to my doctor's appointment and when they did the ultrasound, he measured the baby and he says, oh, your baby's measuring six days smaller than your due date. So we could move your due date six days up um, or like back, which would make instead of October 18th, it would be October 24th. I didn't think much about that, but he's like, I said, oh, I don't want to move the due date. He's like, okay, well, it's within the grace period, so we can just leave it the same. It's your sixth baby, it's fine. So he, he said I could leave it as October 18th, but I just kind of knew October 24th is like this date in my head. I look up this ancestor's birthday, you guys are gonna die, October 24th literally is this person's birthday. I told you, I was like, I know this is the name. Like I felt like a spiritual confirmation several times, it just, I'm like, this is the baby's name, so I have to win this, you guys. And then Davey, this is funny, he's working at the temple this morning, and what do you know? That name comes through the temple, and he's like, I started crying because I knew that that could be the name, and that it was like, he was okay with it. So I feel like even if you won, you would still name Let's the name. Let's be honest, guys. My name? I think we both know what the name of this baby is. I know, so. Do you want to just get off the bus so I can name how, or here's the deal is I don't care about the middle name. So I will let you pick the middle name if you get off the bus. But I am not getting off and you will sit here and watch me suffer if you don't get off. I get the middle name? Yes. 
I got one picked out. I'm fine, whatever it is. Or you get off and you get the middle name. <sighs> I'm like 99.99% .99 sure I'm gonna win this because I'm willing to pee my pants on the bus, I'm willing to throw up on the bus, and Here's I the problem. will not leave I've until I've actually you. <laughs> had spiritual confirmation that this is the name of the bus. And now you like it, right? Yes. <laughs> I wanna make I'm it just glad little. that Palolo is not the name. Yeah, that's not happening. Palolo. That's horrible. Not Palolo. <laughs> Do you know that Okay, Davey, step off the bus, be a man. What? Wait, oh, please. he's doing it! He's stepping off the bus, honey, thank you. You're so nice. I'm so thankful for the temple this morning, because that... Oh, he's not that out! tipped him over the edge to where I think he knows I'm right. He jumped out! Okay, what's the name? <laughs> okay, no, wait, I'm not wait, telling what? you until the rest of the kids get in here. Oh, come on! I'm so happy. Fine, I get middle name. Okay, I get first name. Okay, what's you guys, the I can't wait to tell you because I love this name now. It never stuck out to me with the other kids. It's like, it was meant to be for this little boy. And I have to tell you also, this is another fun part of the story. When we were in Thailand on our couples trip, like all these couples trips stories, but when we were in Thailand on our couples trip, the last day of the trip, Jordan Page, fun cheaper free, came down to breakfast the day we were leaving and she said, guys, I'm pregnant. And we were all like, oh my gosh, congrats. And I, at that point, was a thousand percent done having kids. A million percent done having kids. She says to me, and oh, I had the weirdest dream last night. You had a little baby boy. Like, you had a little baby boy. And I know, like, it was you. And I said, Jordan, that's not happening. No. And she was like, I know, it's so weird. So Jordan actually had, she had the first little vision of this baby a year, a year ago. <laughs> And me and Davey were both just like, not happening. And then when I found out I was pregnant with the last baby was the day that she had her baby. And then I miscarried that one sadly, but then that's what's so funny because it's led us to this point where like we wanted to have another one. And here it is a little boy. And another little hint to the name is I'm also naming the baby partially after my grandparent first, but then Jordan also. And it's not Jordan. Jordan is not the name, but it's part of Jordan's name. So I bet you guys are guessing it now. And now Paula is looking on Instagram trying to figure that out. <laughs> so, Wait, what? so I have two dear friends that this is going to be like kind of named after also. Three. Three. If my middle name gets through. That's true. Three dear friends that we like cherish and it's love. Name. It's every part of this name is so special to us. I'm so excited. What's the first letter? I'm not telling you. Wait till the kids come out. It's, it's not Jordan. That's what I'm telling you, because that could have been a boy or a girl name, but I don't have any ancestors named Jordan that I know of. So it's not that. You better go check on the kids now that you've gotten out of the bus, no? I wanna let the kids finish their shopping experience. It's uh, it's good for it's them to character building. Money. That's true. Like if they get up there and they have not they enough money, enough. then they have to figure out what to put I back. Want them to finish, they look like a couple orphans in there, but they're gonna make it through. Someone's gonna be like, "Who brought these kids?" <laughs> I am in this random little small window of feeling good right now. Yeah. Zade, I was like really sick, and I'm like, "Bring me something. My I need a mint or something." He brought up this Kern's Nectar Peach. This video Calm my not stomach. Sponsored by Kearns. Not sponsored by Kearns, but that did the trick this time. I just never know what it's gonna be. Sometimes, like a mint, I'll pop a mint in my mouth and like that'll calm my stomach. But that time. But then I'm like, oh, I should probably try to eat some more of this. I'm terrified if I take a bite, I'm gonna get sick again. Oh, welcome oh, back. Welcome back. I won. Trip. Just so you know. You won. I won. Of course you did. Of course you did. <laughs> like. Everyone just knew I was gonna win. Good job, EB. You guys get all the stuff? We got a Globe Beach Plus, two Sour Patch Kids, Mike and I. And of Fanta. course, they're gonna share with me. Yeah. A bunch of fake right. things. Woo! Okay. You won? I won. Oh, you got some hair? Yes, Lego Cat. Dollar Store haul. I got some Lego Cat. That's beautiful. I what love it. Yeah. Yes. Baby's showing us her stuff. Whoa, Evie! Yeah, yeah. I had a nickel. Look at those cookies. I, I've been saving up a bunch of money for a little while and I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get a mini fridge. Oh. Because I'm sick of putting all, all, all my cold drinks and stuff in the fridge. And then I, I go away for a second, I walk back, all of it's gone. Boom, gone. Oh, kids. Yeah. That's how I feel in my cold drinks that I put in my fridge from you. <laughs> okay, now I wanna know the name. Hey, everybody, 
Come forward. April's going to announce she won the game. I'm going to tell you the She's going to announce the game. So this person is my grandpa. I don't know your grandpa. Fred. No, that's, my grandpa. that's dad's grandpa. And it could George. be a boy name and a girl name. And my due date, if you go off the ultrasound due date and not the, like the due date is the same as this, my grandpa's birthday. Okay. What do you guys think his name is? Um, we don't know what your okay, grandpa's name tell is. My grandpa's name was Francis, and we called him. I was Francis. right! Grandpa Frank. We gave you some pretty good hands. Like I you, was like right! You, like you get yeah. it. We're going to call our baby Frank. Frankie. Uh, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, I I'm sorry. 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 I'm Rockwell. Francis Rockwell, Frankie Rock, or Frankie Jill. Rocco. Frankie. Frankie Rocco. Rockwell comes from a person, a great man named Porter Rockwell. And the Shumway's little baby boy that they lost was also named Rockwell. Hey, mommy, I got a special name. So that's the name, special. guys. This name is so, so special. My grandpa, due on his birthday, which is so amazing. And then I'm still going to keep my doctor's appointment as the 18th as the due date because I want to have the baby a little bit earlier than that but we'll see maybe we don't know. It comes when it comes. Well I know what if the baby comes on my grandpa's birthday that'd be crazy that totally could happen. Um, All right guys Frankie, that's but, it so Frankie, Frankie Rockwell or Gail Francis I am on board with it I this is Frankie, the right name. Oh. Completely. Frankie Rocco. There's a lot of good nicknames. <laughs> I'm excited. And I was oh, like, God. that could be a boy or a girl. Francis, Franny, Frank, Frankie. Like, I'm There's so happy. Like, even if the ultrasound shows that this is a girl, it's still Frankie. It's still Francis. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Rockwell might change if it is a girl. But the blood test said boy, and I'm sure of it. It's a boy. We gave and Paul, Jordan's dream. Yeah, yeah, we gave Paula yeah. the hint of the... The Assisi Cathedral yeah, in she Italy. It. She Googled it. Saint Francis. So. Yeah, well, like, He's you know, a saint. Saint Francis. Yeah. Oh, Francis. Yes. Jordan Francis Page. Jordan Francis Page. And then Ruby and Kevin Frankie. So I'm like, there's so many special meanings to this name, but the most special is my grandpa, my mom's dad, Grandpa Frank. We love him. Everyone loves Grandpa Frank. He was always happy. He was hilarious. He was amazing at family history. He wrote books. He had like a degree in literature. He was so smart. I'm so excited to name this baby after him. And that's it. Okay, guys, that's it. Last to leave. April got to Frankie name the child. We're so excited for this baby. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Find good in everything.